My name is Taylor Holt and welcome to my summer 2021 co-op wrap-up video. This summer I worked for the Ministry of Forests in the beautiful Revelstoke and surrounding areas. I'm a fourth year co-op student at the University of Victoria majoring in biology with a concentration in forest biology. I took lots of forestry courses in school and so this summer was a great opportunity to apply the textbook knowledge that I had previously acquired. The start of my work term involved plenty of prep work and training to get me ready for the busy field season. This included courses in chainsaw training, GIS and map making, danger tree awareness, and bear awareness, which we saw plenty of. Uh, other prep work included organizing of licensee site plans and asking a million questions under the sun. Our first big field project of the summer was at M7 in Golden, where we marked the location, identified the seed lot, and identified the species of every single tree that was planted. This is quite extraordinary in the world of research, as someone can come back to this site, pull up the GPS coordinates, and walk right up to the tree that they're interested in analyzing. My supervisor for the summer was Diane Miller, a spunky, knowledgeable, and overall awesome human being. We did a lot of FREP work, FREP standing for Forest and Range Evaluation Practice. So we went to cut blocks that had been recently harvested and analyzed the forest and the stream health based off of the different management tactics that have been applied by the licensees. This included surveys in water quality, riparian, stand level biodiversity, and visuals. I also got the opportunity to do field work with other groups and organizations in the Revelstoke area. These field days included tree planting inspections with stewardship, as shown here, waste inspections and scaling checks with scaling, timber cruise checks with BC Timber Sales, and hemlock looper population monitoring with Parks Canada. It was awesome to meet new people and make new connections. A big highlight of my summer was the Hemlock Looper Spray Program that happened in July over Lake Revelstoke. I worked alongside the regional entomologist, Marnie Duffy Holt, who is also my mother. Here's a video of one of the helicopters taking off at first light, so they're carrying BTK on board, and this was at 0400, so yes, that is the moon at the top of the video. Also pictured here are the many hordes of mosquitoes attacking my phone, which required me to purchase a mosquito head net later on in the week, which saved my life. <laughs> this is a crazy cool experience, even with the early mornings starting at 2 a.m. and the very incessant bugs. Hemlock looper moths are defoliators of many different trees in the Revelstoke area, including hemlock, cedar, and Douglas fir. Here's a video of a filament bear caterpillar, which is not a hemlock looper, but it has the same movement of inching along. Also, it looks like a tiny little dinosaur to me, so you're welcome. My May to August consisted of many different modes of transportation. I rode in a helicopter four times, had the opportunity to put my ATV skills to use up at a backcountry ski lodge in the cusp with the scaling crew, and I put many kilometers on the ministry trucks performing prep work all over the Selkirk district. Unusual transportation means fantastic views for snacking and great pictures to brag to your friends. This summer exceeded my expectations in the quality of learning, the views experienced, and of course the connections that were made along the way. I was also very fortunate to bring my dog Moose along on most of the field excursions, um, which is also very nice. Thank you to everyone who played a role in shaping me as an up-and-coming forest biologist. I had an amazing summer and I can't wait to get out there again. Thanks for watching.